All right, guys, we are exploring Hogsmeade. So we've got tombs and scrolls, Ollivanders, Pippins, potions, and the magic neat to go explore and whatever else is along the way. All right, I don't have anything unlocked yet. Oh, so many places to go. Ollivanders. Was there a swirl? There was a swirl. Wands of variety, woods, and all manners of flexibility. Okay. Oh, there's challenges just for. No, I don't want the map. Um. Just for Hogsmeade, huh? Field guide. Okay, so this is for Hogwarts, this is for Hogsmeade, and this is for something that we haven't discovered yet. Maybe the forest? What do we got? Zonko's chief prankster spectacles. Alright. Next is the prankster hat. Quests we're working on. It's assignments, main quests, and relationships. Alright, All right, let's pick a wand. Bin. Chest. Light herbologist hat. Rebellion. Oh, hey. See it? On the other side, there's a page to collect. Outside. And there was something over there, too. Alright, let's call. Oh, hello. I'll be right with... Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Uh, hmm. Hello, sir. I'm looking for... For a new wand, yes. It's about time. Yes, I... About time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect wand, shall we? Mm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes. Yes. Mm, powerful core. Let's see how Ten I react. Half inches. Mm, you might do. Yeah. Give this one a try. Hats are staring at each other over here. Well, go ahead. Swish. <laughs> Fizzle. Oh, uh, once more. Come on. Really swish it. Oh, dear. <laughs> well, this That's isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um... We'll find you something, not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, hmm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. It's a pretty one. Has not usually the third? Th oh, where to go? There it is. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. <sighs> Third time the charm, right? This is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. The green one? Yes. I 
think you might be the one. Here, take it. But what is it? Green, dark brown, finalized wand. Oh, I can change it. Hornbeam, unicorn hair, brittle, 10 inches. How intriguing. Oh, okay. What do I want it to look like? I like the natural gray. Curious indeed. Oh, that's neat. The spiral. How intriguing. Let's go through them all. I still like the spiral. Curious indeed. Oh, hold on. Oh, it changes back. How intriguing. Green, gray. That was another neat shape. Notched. Not so much. Curious indeed. The classic is boring. A soft spiral. That's the spiral with this. How intriguing. A stalk, like a stalk of grass. And yeah. That was the original. Curious indeed. What about this one? No, I'm going for the spiral in the green, I think. The crooked spiral's kind of neat though. How intriguing. Yes, Ollivander, we know. No, the spiral in the green. Hornbeam? I don't know. What are the options? Curious indeed. Arch, laurel, maple, pear. Does it change? It's it, it's not changing shape or color. So, what are these properties? Oops, wrong button. Oh, for five, six. Right. Curious indeed. Apple, ash, aspen, beech, blackthorn, cedar, cherry, chestnut. I don't know. Ebony. That would be kind of neat. How intriguing. Pear. Willow. Could be that. Silver lime. Oh, sycamore. Curious indeed. Ten and a half, brittle. How intriguing. So many options. Whippy. Don't want it brittle. Curious indeed. Swishy. Supple. How intriguing. Supple. Known for producing consistent magic. Powerful magic. A great range of magic. We're going to go with the ah, Phoenix Feather. Phoenix Feather. Exceptionally rare. And a call with a strong sense Purchase. of initiative. I'll hold it down. What do you think? Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. Ah. <laughs> Now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. 
The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. Of course. And a phoenix feather core is terribly so an excellent match indeed. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Rabanda. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. All right, that was effective. I've got my wand. Now, there was a page. Somewhere. Bird. Zonkos. I'm not here to play with stuff at Zonkos. Oh, just flew right overhead, didn't it? Here it comes. Yeah. All right. So many nooks and crannies. What are you doing hanging out here? Wine and chocolate? Rats. Hmm, it's kind of foggy. Do they have a changing weather system? That'd be neat if it rains. Stormy, blistery. Days, potions. Oh, I can break things. Two chests in here. Welcome to J. Pippin's potions. Simple. Oh, what are we getting from you? Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm going to have a hard time hearing Professor Weasley. Sure, student, she's Keep thinking of Ron Weasley. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. But for now... Let's get you those recipes, shall we? What can I do for you today? Ed Edoras potion recipe causes a rocky film to develop on your skin, helping protect them from harm. Yep. Wigan Weld potion, uh, healing, perfect. Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory. Or Focus. come back another time if you're in okay, a rush so today. For a spell cooldowns. 
the damage potion, invisibility, increases the speed, the drinker's spell damage for a limited amount of time. Come on, Cookie. It's our little kitty. Cookie. Sweet as a cookie. And then the ingredients. What's here? Oh, this is if I want to sell items. No. Hmm, I can't spend that one. So again, behind here, it was blue flames. Um, what is raining? There you are. Oh, totally missed. And again. Tree in the way. Back over. About here. Can't see her, but the cat sitting on the futon. Footstool. Some such thing. Watching me fail at my wand work. Why would I need to trim a tree? Okay, I'm sure there's a reason for that. Chest. Thank you. Nothing in them. Wow, I can just go everywhere. Really? You don't mind me eating your apples? Level one. Things level one. I'd rather scrape cream to work with mud. Okay, chopped in some wood. Down with Rockwood, extortionists. Okay, cranky with the ministry. Duly noted. It's a bit of a rougher area. I'm gonna run down in places. This is where we walk through. Vanders I've been to. Zonko's is over there. We haven't been down here. Handy yeah. resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Got a picture frame. Okay, so a really big tree. Oopsies. 
There's two lights. There's a gate. I don't know if that's a barrel or a bench at the end of that stone fence. Maybe a cherry tree in the back. I'm not too sure where that's going to be. Something to keep an eye open for. Tissue's not too far, is it? Oh, it's right here. Almost. See? The moth's right there. Hi! Yes. I thought it would be harder than that. Follow your gut. Come on, sweetie. Voila! Can't tell what level I am. I moved the portrait. And now it's covering it. So hopefully there's no crucial messages there. Level 3? Hard to tell when it's red. Kind of blend together those words. Flutes and lutes. No, I need tombs and scrolls and the magic meat. Yes, I could look at the map, but I don't want to. I want to wander around and see what else is here. Bingle and Batch. Bingle and Blatch. Ollivanders. The three broomsticks. Zonkos to the right. It's nothing but a door. More Zonkos. We'll have to go in there. There's a page. Oh, that was an easier one. Do 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 do. Hello, little window in the middle of nowhere. <clears throat> Kitty. Pretty markings. Yeah. Then, yeah. Water well. Okay, so pay attention to water wells. Maybe there's something special about them. They said not this one, but other ones, right? Don't need the map. Okay, I got the prankster hat. Next is the prankster coat. Love the little details. Scriven shaft. Wizard wear. Oh, I think I have a cat under my blanket. Yes. One cat, my little one, is under the blanket. My big one, Tony, is on the outside, staring, wondering who is going to attack him. Okay, I am trimming, sure. <laughs> Tony. My Tony pounced. Owl office? Post office? All the way around the building, probably. There it comes. Getting 
better. Rebellion. Yeah, basically anything that looks interesting. Be something for a field guide. So, chest and something here. Oh, the food pot. Yeah, let's trim. What's this? Oh, well, that's fun. Another page coming out. Of the a dodo? I told you not to go down that path. Miss Peck from Rude and Peck said a customer lost a deer call around here. I know we're not supposed to go down there. I just thought you could have got her a lot of trouble. I'm very sorry, Father. Only she said I might earn a reward. Uh, instead, I just wasted our time. There you are. Huh. Finally, I'll have enough of that wind wisp. Ah, well, not meant to be. Also, I may have knocked over a dustbin back there. Never mind, I'll fix it. As always. Okay, so what do we do with those? Maybe if I go to the magic neap, I'll find out, but... Um, Akio? Or Levioso? I don't think it would have gotten too far. That was a complete and utter mess. I'm gonna level up again. Level eight. Are probably another page. Just see it. Well, flickering there. Anyways, we need to find tombs and scrolls and the magic neat. And he said, "Don't go down here." So what are we gonna do? What are you? How do I open you? I like you. Green eye. I don't know. Nope. Light. Well, none of my skills. So there'll be something. Maybe I have to bring something to it. where I can change my hair if I so wish.
Yeah, I don't feel like it. I like my purple braid. But now I know where I can go. Pushing well. That's where I just came from. Lots of cats. I just came down from here. Just houses, potions, a flu shop, a flu powder. All right, map it is. Oh, but I haven't seen you. Poor the shell. Dresser, wizard wear, brood and pack. Honey dukes. Oh, the magic meat. I didn't go far enough. The old fool. Head. Tombs and scrolls. That was the one, wasn't it? So go back to Ollivander's. Oh, I'm almost there. Follow the road straight, turn a right. Side. An inquiring mind. Interesting. Come on, around the chair. Side. The book over there. What are those little dots? Hmm. Oh, there's a book in here. Alright. You see in the ceiling? Oh. Ah, fantastic. I love it. Something here. All right. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spell crafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. Matilda Weasley. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then. I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest. Creating something out of nothing. Mm, of course, it is not without complexity. But that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course. 
And you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when we want. Let's have a look. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Okay, so the two tables. Potting table. Oh, cookie. If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. Lots of things. Potting table with two large pots. Composter. Chopping station. Okay, but we're running out of time. Oh, Cookie. She likes to sleep with her head on the leg. It makes her choke. So inside, there's that one, but inside the building there was something. immediate way in unless I can climb anyways I need to get across the river Oh, it's another one of you. Yes, I had to open you. Oh, I don't have time, but I gotta remember. So, where are we? Let's see if I can quickly figure it out. Okay, that was the dock, the lamp. It's just over here, isn't it? Only on the other side. There you are. Oops. Lumos. bridge. Okay, I'm going to stop right in front because I'm sure the meat is going to unlock something about, well, it's just plants. But anyways, there's that animal to find, you know, that dodo-like bird. All right, maybe I'll stream tonight, but I'm definitely playing more. Thanks for joining, guys. Unicorn Farts is out.